Hi guys, so today I wanted to go over my boxy charm that I got for the month of July. And I received mine, I believe it was the week of July 17th, I want to say. Um, this is what the box looks like. And this theme was um, Summer in Sparkle. So there's one of the cards that came inside of it. And then just they include just a little welcome like that. And I'll show you what's inside. So this month it came um, packed with, of course, the full-size samples or products. Um, so it kind of looks like that. And uh, first of the products that I'll kind of talk about is um, it's the L'Oreal Sublime Sun Advanced Sunscreen SPF 30. So it looks like this, full-size products. I have not had a chance to try this yet, but it doesn't smell bad. I've never tried any of the sunscreens from L'Oreal Paris, and I know some people actually got the spray, and I was really hoping I was going to get the spray because I like spray sunscreens a little bit better, um, but I got this, so I'll go ahead and give this a try out. Um, from what I've seen at the stores, I think these retail probably right around $7.99 um, for these, and I think I've sometimes seen them come in like a two-pack, but I can't really remember. And then we got a um, nail product. It is the L'Oreal Color um, Nail Laundry Limited Edition Diamond Collection um, in the color, um, color 700 statement piece. So it looks like that. So it basically has just that, that design that's going to go on the nail. And this is uh, a gold print. And then it just kind of tells you how to apply it on your nail. Sorry, this isn't going to pick it up. Um, and they actually, when the collection had come out, it looks like they had um, a couple different colors that you could choose from, and I got that one, so I don't know if everyone got that color or if people got different colors. Or no, actually, wait a minute. They're just, okay, I'm retarded. That is just showing you the design, this design, and how you could top it over all these different colors. Hello. Okay. Moving along. Since... I am not the smartest. Okay. Um, let's see what else. I could have swore that I had gotten a nail product from them. Maybe I didn't. I can't remember. I might have. I think this is all that came out of the box. I can't really remember. And then we got the Revlon Diamond Lust uh, in the color 100 um, Celestial Silver. I don't know if I have this color or not when this collection did come out. That's my kitten in the background. Um, but it's just a, a very shimmery color. So this isn't, a, from what I can remember, I have, I know I for sure have the black one. Um, and I might have had like one from a pink color. I can't really remember. Um, but this collection I know does have a lot of fallouts. And then... A blush. This was from the limited edition Project Runway in the color the Queen's Blush. So that color. Now I know that with BoxyCharm, some of the products are last season's um, products, but I really don't mind it because if there was a product that I couldn't get my hands on when it did come out and it was limited edition somewhere. Um, you know, I have seen limited editions come out and people talk about it and they don't even hit the stores that are by me. So I think um, with BoxyCharm, you know, with them putting in some products that are from last season's or limited edition, I think it's kind of great because if you didn't get a chance to grab it when it was out, you know, you can get it in your box. So that is the color. It's a really pretty color. This will be the first time swatching it, so let me see how the color picks up. It's a pretty color. Looks like it'll be kind of, I think when you apply it to your face, it'll be a little bit darker. Let me see if I can get it. That looks good. So, I don't know, it looks okay. And then um, the only product that I really didn't like um, was the lipstick that they did put in here. It's the Project Runway number 686. Looks like that. And it's just not a color for me. It's just kind of like this burnt orange shade. I don't know. It's just not a color for me, so that'll be something I'll probably just do as like a, 
a giveaway to friends and family if somebody wants it. Um, but I think that was pretty much all that I had gotten in the box. I don't, for whatever reason, I feel like there was like another nail product, like a nail polish, but I'm probably thinking of next month. Um, cause I think they did like a spoiler where they were going to put in a L'Oreal, ah, I can't talk, a L'Oreal nail polish. Um, so, um, that'll be next month. And I just keep rambling, so I'm just going to go ahead and stop now. So that's what I got in this month's, uh, Boxy Charm box. If you guys have any questions, um, it is a $21 a month subscription box and they are new, so I think they do have a couple glitches that they're still working out in the system. Um, but I think, you know, for overall for $21 a month, uh, you get some limited edition products that could come in the box that you could not have had the chance to get. Um, and I know some people had issues with um, maybe the products are expired and stuff like that. I mean, I don't even. T yeah, I mean, I don't even see, like on the sunscreen, I don't see like a expiration, you know, maybe there was one on the box or something, but I mean like for makeup and stuff, sometimes they'll put the expiration dates I've seen on foundations and stuff, um, so, I'm, yeah, I don't really know, but I, I doubt that they would send you a product that's, you know, two years old, so, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one, bye-bye.